right, plenty of action going down this weekend, so how about we set the table, Browns and Broncos, and oh, by the way, Denver, they haven't lost to the Browns since I was in seventh grade, 1990, Rod, seventh grade. Ooh. Pats and Steelers, Tom Brady, as we heard, 11-2 and two in his career versus Pittsburgh during the regular season. Saints and Panthers on Monday night football, total access endgame. It's going to be jumping the Saints back-to-back division champs for the first time in team history in team history so nobody say anything about Cooper. all right fellas you know what time it is time to put all out there week 15 questions and they are of the burning variety so let's get down to business mjd uh, we all know that ty hilton is questionable ahead of this cowboys colts matchup but better quarterback wide receiver duo on sunday dak and coop or Luck and T.Y. Before I answer this question, I didn't even know you passed the sixth grade. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I, ba- really? Barely. What? Barely. Okay. Because we had talked through. about that the other day. S- yeah, but through. going back to the question, um, I got to go with Andrew Luck and T.Y. Hilton. T.Y. barely practiced last week, came back out against the Texans, had 199 yards receiving. Mm-hmm. Are you kidding me? I got to go with that. I know that team is going to try to throw the ball where the Cowboys are going to be more of a run first. I get it. Dak had a ton of yards last week. But remember, they went into overtime. And the Eagles' whole secondary was banged up. I don't see them doing that this week against the Colts. And, oh, by the way, Andrew Luck has 11 games with two or more passing touchdowns. So, have fun with that. Rob, we're going to check in with one of your former teams, the Steelers. Uh, They're they're hosting the Patriots Sunday. So, when it comes to X Factor, who's going to be in this one? It is the secondary for the Pittsburgh Steelers. You guys need to call in Mike Tomlin. All you guys need to go to Mike Tomlin's office, and you team to tell Mike Tomlin, we're going to man up. We're going to put man-to-man against the the New England Patriots receivers. We're going to let our front seven eat. We're going to cover the back end, and you guys can get a victory. Rod sounds pretty confident, but hold on, Rod. Bam, 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 bam. <laughs> hold on. The, the Patriots are five and one over the last ten years during the regular season. Hey, Red Bones don't post a hurt. Uh, don't post a hate. We're, we're yeah. supposed to be hand we're in hand. Together, here. That's all right. Let's let's, nope, let's join forces <laughs> against him, but we'll keep this one rolling because MJD Titans at Giants. We yeah. have more yards. Derrick Henry. Or Saquon, the chef, Barkley. I've, I've been on record saying that Derrick Henry starts running in December, which he does. We he saw does. what he did last week against the Jags. But he I'm going to say Saquon Barkley because Odell Beckham's out. you got to lean on this running game. Second and their offensive game. line is doing a heck of a job creating holes. And he's coaching his offensive line on the sidelines. I don't know if you're on Twitter, Rod. I don't know if you're you know, ready for all that. I don't know. But if you are, <laughs> there's a thing on Twitter where Saquon was like, look, you guys do this, this, and this, and I'm going to do that, and we're going to make it happen. And then guess what? He did it. He did exactly and that. It, and it happened. Yeah, he got his Miss Cleo hat on. And no oh, by the way, he's on pace for over 2,100 scrimmage yards. So the young what? man, he's doing his he's thing bald. for Big Blue this year. How about this one, Rod? Packers at the Bears. We talked about that a little bit earlier. But bigger number, Rodgers touchdowns or Bears sacks? You know what? Come on now. Don't First of all, me. Shaquan Barkley, he's the best running back in the game. Anyway, okay. now let's go Ooh, this. All right. Is wow. He, look, Aaron yeah, Rodgers. Doubling down on your Aaron Rodgers. Aaron Rodgers threw three touchdowns in that first game, week one. They had four sacks. Oh. So Aaron Rodgers might have three, but they're going to have four. They're going to have five because, listen, Mack, Goldman, Hicks, those guys have been eating all year long. And Aaron, yeah, he's a little healthier, but they're going to keep eating. And in the back end secondary, they're picking the ball off too. So, I like the I like the Where's sack the number for the for the Bears. Chicago, Chicago. Right. that's where that's their right. defense play the best. Right off the Lakeshore Drive, and that hawk it will be coming. Chicago first and sacks at 25, and oh by the way, they won six of their last seven. Now we move along to the NFC North because Saints in Carolina on Monday Night Football. Better fantasy back, Alvin Kamara, or Lil Sweet. Christian McCaffrey. Yeah, you know what? When I when I look at both of these guys, I think they do the same thing. So it's about volume, okay. right? So I'm gonna have to go with Christian McCaffrey because guess what? He's a sweet one. He's a sweet one. He, he will is. get all the carry. Okay. They gonna give him everything. Cam's gonna hand it to him. Cam's gonna throw it to him. Cam's gonna do whatever he can to get this guy going. So it has to be this guy. Alvin Kamara is still sharing the backfield with Mark Ingram. Mark Ingram late in the year tends to run better. Okay. And so it's gonna be outside. I think Mark Ingram's gonna be the guy. So I'm gonna have to go with. Okay, well, over his first two years, Christian McCaffrey has the most scrimmage yards in Carolina Panther history. So, tip of the cap to you, Christian. Rod, Browns at the Broncos, part two of our Saturday Double Dip right here on NFL Network. More sacks. I'm giving you three options. Von Miller, Miles Garrett, or Bradley Chubb. What say you? I'm going to go Miles Garrett because Case Keenum's been sacked 30 times already. And you know what? The one thing that I would say the little guy that wakes up being dangerous in Cleveland, yeah, 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 yeah. he can get in and out of the pocket. He can cause some issues for defensive ends and people rushing the quarterback. So I'm going Miles Garrett getting out the quarterback case team. You're in a Garrett state of mind. You brought in some Garrett's popcorn today. Feeling pretty good hey, about that. You yeah, brought that thanks. Y'all thanks. Like that. Oh, by the Y'all way, like for that, that, yeah, that, yeah, that, like that triple mix was going hard. You. So is Miles that. Garrett. Second in the league with 12 and a half sacks. And uh, speaking of Saturday football, yeah, it's going to be a nice little. 